I am in a remote island in Greece, quite beautiful. I'll give you a bit of a view at the moment. So here is what we have going. You can see the sea on this side. I'm at a little villa for the week, just similar to South Africa. The nature of the bush, the fresh air, the no pollution, no car pollution, noise pollution, people pollution, politics. What I want to show you is you're going to get this table today, which is the Much Trader Supreme Index track record and journal, what you're used to. And it says over here, Supreme Track Record Week. Now, why it says week is because now each day has what its weekday is, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, etc. We've got our week number according to the year, which is very important for working it out. And then if we scroll on the right, you will see here, very important, we have loss or gain, close the net points. So that includes the average spread of 20 points or 40 points, whatever it is that you can put there. And the loss or gain week netly, netly, <laughs> the net weekly gain or loss is highlighted in black and white. Okay. So at the end of the week, this is what we made. At the end of the week, this is what we lost. At the end of the week, this is what we made. Okay. And it goes on all the way until today. Now you can see that since here, this is where we've adapted the ghost rule and the results have just skyrocketed. So which means that we are doing better with Supreme than we've ever done in the track record and back testing, forward testing and real testing before I launched the service. So I don't know what to expect at the end of the year with these type of results, but it's very exciting. We just have to have the patience to endure the entire process. It's just been logical, like why it works and how we do it. And I'm sure your emotions are um, reducing a lot more because you understand the process a lot better. So this is what you're going to get today. You'll click on that link saying download the track record and now you've got the weekly stuff. So now if we go here, it says Mati HPT week stats, which means the Supreme Much Trader High Probability Trade Weekly Stats. Here is how it works. We have the complete week stats from April 2023 to July 2024. The total number of weeks have been 70 weeks total. The number of winners was 54. The number of losers was 16 weeks. The win rate is 77%, right? The gain in points was 26,617 points. The loss in points was 4,056 points. The biggest winning week was 2,152, and the biggest losing week was 759 points. So the average profit and loss, including costs, was 322 points. So you can see what I've done here. I've put the weekly number over here and the points. And this is something that we've got to think about because... We can't base our trading track record and stats on a day. When we take a loss, we should not reflect it on the past of the track record. Also, when it comes to the month, I do understand that it takes a long time to go through an entire month, okay? And uh, then you wanna see how you did. So that is why I broke up from the daily to the monthly, and then in between, we've done the weekly. So you can expect on a year to year basis of what you can uh, expect with the weeks. So you can see here green, 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 green. Then we have a red week, red week. And it gives you an idea that we do have losing weeks with Supreme. We, we might not have many losing months with Supreme, but we do have losing weeks. So you can see here we had three losing weeks in a row. So we have to prepare for it. We got to get rid of those emotions because this is inevitable. Your biggest losing streak is still to come, but also your biggest winning streak is also to come. So you can see here, there were three losing weeks in a row. Then here were six winning weeks in a row. Here were six winning weeks in a row. Two weeks ago, we took a losing week. So far, we're up 17 points, okay? So that was for week 35. So I hope this helps and it gives you a more 
better idea of what type of stats you can get with Supreme and also you can do it with your own trading. The other thing I wanted to show you, so here is the Mighty Index High Probability Trade Stats. I have changed it where instead of dealing with RANDs, we are now going to be dealing with points because your portfolio is different to mine, is different to his and hers. So these are all points now that you can expect to make or lose. The profit and losses excluding costs in points, the profit and losses including costs in points right here. We had a 77% win rate. We had seven winning trades in a row in August. We had one set of losing trades in a row in August. The profit and losses excluding costs was 2,615. The profit and losses including costs was 2,355 which means we had a very successful August. And now we're going to be basing the stats on the, okay, we've got the days, we got the weeks, and now we got the months. Is that useful? Does that help? Does it give you more transparency and idea of what to get with trading? So if you do have a losing week, go back to the stats and you will say, you know what, there were three losing weeks once upon a a time or even four losing weeks and yet i kept taking the trades i kept building the portfolio and at the end my portfolio is at all-time high so what do i care about the losses if i care about the losses i care about my ego and i'm approaching a narcissistic way of trading if i approach trading as a database right where it has chop trend chop trend then I know that I'm going to be successful.